This is Lion TV News. Good morning, Carter Lions. This is Carter High School, the best high school in the IE, where we pride ourselves on being respectful, responsible, and ambitious. I'm Ivy Gutierrez, and this is Lion TV News. I'm Mia, and we are in the last quarter. We need to hear you roar. This is our school-wide expectations. ROAR stands for respectful, open-minded, ambitious, and responsible. That is how we ROAR. I'm Emily Cano. Hey, Carter Lyons. Do you like poetry? Do you like to write short stories, poems, or even rap? Well, then listen up. The Carter High School Library would like to invite all of our students to participate in our Poetry Slam on April 28, 2023, during both lunches. Poetry Slam sounds like a mysterious, scary, and even intimidating thing. Will poetry books fly through the air and suddenly slam into your face? Not at all. In fact, poetry slams are just reading poems aloud in a public place to celebrate. The very first poetry slam happened in 1986 in Chicago. Since then, poetry slams have spread throughout the world, both competitively and for fun. Typically, poems read at poetry slams have a strong rhythm to them and are often on issues that the speaker is very passionate about. But they don't always have to rhyme. Either way, the important part is to care about the poems you choose and to love to read them out loud. Students may use original work or something from your favorite poet. All work must be school appropriate. If you have any questions and to submit your poems, please contact Ms. Hernandez in the library. Remember, the deadline is April 21st to participate. Have a great day. I'm Angel Raya, attention seniors. Prom tickets are now on sale during both lunches. Prom is open to juniors and seniors. Tickets are $110 without, with ASB and $130 without. Please stop by the student store reception desk or counseling desk for a permission slip. All attendees must turn in a permission slip to purchase a ticket. I'm DeClavius Jones from Career and Counseling, senior at the Delbaca Job and College Fair is on April 13th. Please pick up permission slip from the Career Center. Space is limited. Seniors, do you plan on attending San Bernardino Valley College in the fall and are interested in visiting the campus? If so, please stop by Career Center for more information. Freshmen, sophomores, and juniors, if you are interested in earning a certificate in pharmacy technology, child development, heavy, medium, duty, clean vehicle technology, water supply technology, or certified network associate, then please complete the Google form that is located in your grade level Google Classroom. Stay hungry and don't forget to roar. Thank you. Sports Report. I'm Ricky Sanchez with Carter Sports. The track and field team competed in the Covina Interventional at the Covina District Track. The meet had over 45 schools competing that meet. For the boys, legend Lions and freshman Shane Jacoby ran a big PR in the 100 and 200 meter dash. Freshman Alex Esqueda, who had a set an all-time freshman record in a 1600 this week and placed third overall out of 65 athletes. In 800 and ran a new league letting time in the 400 meter run. For the girls, they started off the meet by running a new season Best time and placing first overall in the 4 by 100 relay with Abdi Staden, Eileen Emerson, Nani Jones, and Michaela Taylor. The Lady Lions continue to have plenty of new personal records throughout the meet with Sadi, Golfos, Michaela Taylor, Mia Soto, Mara Carlos, Abdi Staden, Nani Jones, and Eileen Emerson. Eileen Emerson was the top female sprinter of the meet as she placed first overall in both the 100 and 200 meter dash. There were plenty of new personal records for the athletes on the team by that day and the girls were able to secure the overall team plaque as the team champions of the Covina Interventional. I'm Michaela with Carter's Entertainment News. Hey Carter, don't miss our spring play, Dorothy Meets Alice or the Wizard of Wonderland by Joseph Robinette. See the flyers around campus for the details. Here's a synopsis of the play. This lovely play of the delightful meetings of two of literature's most famous young ladies unfolds when a young man puts off a book report to the last minute, then suddenly finds himself in a strange place somewhere between Oz and Wonderland. It then becomes his responsibility to unscramble the stories and steer the familiar characters, the Cowardly Lion, the Mad Hatter, the Scarecrow, and the Right Wabbit among others to their ultimate destinations while avoiding the Wicked Witch and the Red Queen. This hilarious, adventurous romp is filled with laughter and surprises at every turn. 
and a couple of lessons emerge along the way as well. Remember, if you don't like the way things are going, then do something about it. Get involved and work towards a solution. Have a great day, Carter Lyons, and remember to roar. Thank you.